Welcome to Lecture Online. In this video, we're going to talk about the terms ratio and proportion. So what do those things mean? Well, ratio is a word used to compare the size of one value to the size of another value. How big is one number compared to another number? So the proper way of writing that and saying that is let's say we have two numbers, A and B. Let's say A is equal to 4 and B is equal to 12. Then we say the ratio of A to B, notice the preposition to, so we're comparing one number to another number. And then we write it as a fraction. So the ratio of A to B can be written as A divided by B, which in this case is 4 divided by 12. And of course, when we simplify that, that's 1 to 3, which means the value of A is one-third the value of B. That's the ratio. That's how we compare one number to the other number. We can also compare angles or the measure of an angle. Let's say the measure of angle 1 is equal to 20 and the measure of angle 2 is equal to 80 and we typically we're talking about degrees. And so when we say the ratio of the measure of angle 1 to the measure of angle 2, it's simply a division. We divide the measure of angle 1 by the measure of angle 2. We write 20 divided by 80, which is 1 fourth, which means that the measure of angle 1 is 1 fourth the measure of angle 2. The word proportion is used when we compare one ratio to another ratio in the form of an equation. So proportion is an equation whose members are ratios. So here we can say that we have A, B, C, and D. Let's say that A is equal to 2, B is equal to 3. So when we compare A to B, when we do the ratio of A to B or take the ratio of A to B, we write A divided by B. We can do the same for C and D. If C is 6 and D is 9, then this is the ratio of C to D. And if those two ratios are equal to each other, then we can write it as a proportion. So A divided by B is equal to C divided by D, and that's the way we write it here. Or we can simply say that A is to B as C is to D. So when we compare A to B and we compare C to D, and those two comparisons are equal to each other, then we have a proportion. So we can therefore write that 2 thirds equals 6 ninths when we replace A, B, and C, D with the values that they're equal to. So this is what we call a proportion. It's say basically setting two fractions equal to each other, and a fraction can be thought of as a ratio, one number compared to another number. And that's how we talk about ratios and proportions.